Hi everyone, it's Jack here at Main Skill. So I see you've tuned in again. Thanks for watching. Keep coming, keep hitting that subscribe button, everybody. So we'll see how many people we can get watching. So I'm glad to see you here. So today's video is going to be a bit different. So it's not going to be farming, but well, it can going to be farming. It's not going to be farming on the actual farm. What it's going to be is today we are off to the farmers market. So what this is, is this is somewhere where a lot of different farmers and local producers go and this is where they go and sell their produce. So what we're doing is we're obviously going with our meat. So we've done farmers markets for a long time now. So in the start, mum and dad, they started out with the meat job by selling it out the back of the car. That's how they started. Before we had any of this farm shop, the butchery or anything, that's how they started. So what they did was the farming job collapsed, it completely went done and what they did is they took three pigs to a local butcher's and said just turn it into sausage. So they just turned it into sausage and what they did is they put me, strapped me in the seat, baby seat, loaded the pigs into the back, the, the sausage and then they went around the local villages and started selling it and that's how they started to get a name for themselves, started selling the meat. So what we're doing today though is we're off to the farmer's market so we're going to get the van loaded now and then me and Claire are going and we're off to Stokesley today actually so there we go good job We're nearly there. It's looking like a lovely weather day. It's raining, it's fairly raining on. But when you get to the wind turbines, you see the wind turbines out there? That's when we know that we're nearly there. So there's quite a few of them around here. So we're nearly there and it looks like we're gonna get wet today. So never mind, we'll soon be there. So we're all settled now, so we got all your sausage and your black pudding to go with your breakfast and your bacon. Then we got to move on to your beef next. So we've got your stewing beef, your mince, and then we've got your steaks. So you've got all your different steaks down here. So your braising steak, sirloin, fillet, ribeyes. So you can see, I'll pick one there, you can see. So you can see it's good beef, well marbled throughout. So it's good stuff. So you've got your big joints. So you've got your, like, your silver side, your top side. Salmon cut, so salmon cuts the muscle in between the top side and the silver side, so it's a very tender joint. Then we move on to the pigs, so these are all our own as well. So you've got your belly pork, 
close favourite. Then you've got your tenderloin, leg of pork, shoulder of pork, loin of pork. It's all your different joints of pork. And then we move on to the lambs. So it'll soon be lambing time. So these are our own lambs, so they're all produced at home. So you've got all your different bits. You've got lamb shank, lamb chops, lamb leg steaks. Then you've got your joints again. So you've got your leg of lamb and your bone and roll shoulder of lamb. So those are some nice joints. Then we've got, it's not barbecue weather, but it's still popular throughout the year. So you've got some burgers, some steakettes. So they're nice, they're different. Then you've got some different flavoured chicken. So we've got the garlic butter, smoky barbecue and Chinese. So it's all different. Offal is very popular at this market where we come to. So we've got your pig liver, your ox liver. Then we've got some kidney and we've actually got some ox heart there as well. And then finally, we've got chickens down the end of the stall here. So all your whole chickens and your chicken fillets. And if you just see along the front, because we have to squeeze a bit more in, that's all your gammons and your bacon bits, smoked gammons and your normal gammons. So there's plenty there, all sorts to go at. Hopefully we get some customers now. So there we go, we've had quite a good morning actually. So if I flick you around, you can see that we've had quite a hammering on here this morning. So we've got no sausage left. So sausage, they've gone mad for them. No mince meat left. Burgers have all gone, bot pudding, uh, steak, there's not a lot of steak left, I think there's one pack of each left, so everything's took a big hammer in. You saw these joints were up here before, they're all gone, and the pork's gone down as well. There's no lamb left apart from a bit of shoulder, so it's been a good morning to be honest, it's gone well. So it's packing up time, Nigel's rung the bell, so Nigel's in charge, he's rung the bell so that means we're allowed to go. As you can see, we've got nought left hardly, so there's only a few bits of pork and beef left, we've got no lamb left, there's only a few chicken breasts, no chickens left, so it's mainly gone, so it's time to pack up in it Claire. Yeah. So that's it, we're all packed up now and ready for home, but I'll just show you. They, we didn't have a single empty crate in here when we come this morning, these are all full of meat. So all them have gone, and that is literally all I've got left. I've got beef in the bottom left, I've got pork on the top left, we've got bacon and gammon on the bottom right, and that's the part of the box of chicken on the top there on the right. So as you can see, we've got nought left really, so it's been a good day really. Good job, that's rid of some meat.